Lanis, hey, welcome back to another episode. Where we at this morning? Derek's here. Darren is gonna join us a little later this morning. Um, probably in the next hour or so. How's it, Derek? Morning, morning. How are you? Laka man, shot. So, um, it said 21 degrees on the car when I, when I jumped out. But coming here, the hey, breeze is a bit cool. It's huh? cold this morning. Just now, it was cold, cold, cold. And I left my jacket in the car then. <laughs> but uh, we'll, see. we'll see, we'll see, we'll <laughs> see. You should know. You should and know. Yeah. Water says it's always different to uh, up. No, absolutely. But it's a nice morning out on the south coast. Um, I'm, we're here in Trafalgar this morning. We're going to scratch for some bream and hopefully some rock cod. We'll yeah. change it up just now. I've just literally just arrived. So let's get to it and uh, we'll see what, what's on the bite. Yeah. Oh yeah, thank you so much for all the new subscribers. Welcome to Ken's Fishing. Thank you for subscribing. The competition is, is going crazy. The competition for accommodation. You can uh, win um, a weekend stay at the beach. The place is called At The Beach. Margate, Chesapeake Bay. So don't, don't forget to get your entries in. I'm going to uh, announce the winner at the end of August. Uh, please, if there's anything you see on my socials announcing winners and or in my YouTube comments, um, there is some spam that's going around. Just be careful. Don't click on any links. I will personally announce the winner at the end of August. Laka, let's get a fish. Let's get a fish. Let's get a fish. Sorry about the wind, guys, but uh, the south is picking up now. Um, I just wanted to show you. I'm fishing with the Okuma Precision. There's the label there. It's the 15 foot, three to six ounce. Beautiful stick. I tried it for the first time at that uh, Okuma cast day. And I've just paired it up with my slammer. Here goes my water. I paired it up with my slammer uh, for DX. And I've got some new braid on there as well. I'm trying out the boss braid. Where it is? Where is it? There we go. Oops. Boss play the high pitch, 40 pound, which is 0.25. The P rating is three. And that gives us a diameter of 0.25 millimeters. So strong as in 40 pound, but thin enough at only 0.25. I'm gonna... Oh yeah. New hooks as well. Hey, new stuff, Lanis. I'm gonna try the landed. Um, this is a 1-0. It's a soy type of ring, it's a J-hook. And this is also a 1-0, just a different style from landed. But what I've got on there now, my trace, I've got one of these BKK chinus. It's a 2-0. Needle points nice and sharp from BKK. So that's the trace I've got on there at the moment. It's a bronzy trace. We got some prawns here from Hookies. Fresh prawn. Half a box or so. Then we got another box. Didn't realize Derek had some as well. So now we got too much bait. But we'll just keep the rest of it closed up. And I'm trying to cover everything because there's not going to be much audio here with this wind. So here's that 2 old chinu that I've got on there. Bronzy trace. You've seen me doing that before. Uh, let's hook up our prawn and we're gonna cast with this okuma 15 foot three to six ounce and hope for the best like a looking stick i like the colors and that's why i chose that yellow boss braid to go with it not just for the color but the strength as well usually fish with 40 pound here in the bricks like our head on prawns one out to shell it. Water's quite low at the moment, I'll show you in a minute. We'll just chuck down here and at the end of our session 
Or maybe now I'll just chum the water a little bit and put them in there. The corn is a little bit soft already, which is fine. I'm going to use the ghost cotton latex thin version, which I always do, especially when I'm fishing for bream or rockfish. Let's just untangle this. go make sure you use all that prawn all that juice all that stuff putting it on lightly not too tight all the way down gonna do is load up because it's low and I'm not gonna walk up and down for bait so we're gonna stick a couple of these okay more than a couple maybe four or five maybe stick those in our bait bucket yeah tub I put my cotton on there as well and I'm just gonna strap it onto my belt. We don't have to walk up and down because it's quite a walk to and from. What's it? It's our rod. It's our rod. Let's go. Gone with a four ounce and it feels very, very light for the stick. Remember, this is a three to six ounce. And it's not an overkill guys, you can definitely scratch with this. What's lacquer is it's so versatile, you could put a bigger bait on here and a smaller bait if you need. Just depends on the style of fishing you're doing. So nothing stopping you from fishing for cob, bronze beam, rock hard. Uh, man, you could even cast a, a livey out on the stick. And the advantage of that is you just need to bring one stick down to the beach and not a whole lot of sticks if you're with me on that. So I'm going to give this uh, a swing now. Let's have a look at the water. It's a beautiful color this morning and it's looking absolutely machine. I'm enjoying this, uh, this color I'm seeing here because last week it was a little too clean for my liking. So it's looking a lot better. Nice ginger tint to it. I'm going to keep this to a limited guys because it's really blowing right now. The south at the moment, uh, not coming off the sea yet. I can just feel it coming from the south. On! Oh yeah, on! Oh yeah! That's so beautiful. Yo! Nice little bump there. Rod's performing really well. First cast, and we're on. Good splashes there in the front. Very sensitive tip for this big stick. And just performing really well all together. What do we have here? My goodness, it looks like a Bartman. No, yes, it is a Bartman. Oh, that's a first for me. Bartman. No, I've heard Jake talk about stories about this fish for so long. I've been fishing in Trafalgar three years now, and it's the first Bartman for me. Wow, look at that hook. Number 2 BKK did the job. This fish didn't waste time. Lovely stuff. Absolutely awesome. Yeah. 
What a nice fish. And look at that hookup. 2-0 BKK. Nicely does it with the fresh hookies prawn. And his uh, tassel fish or Bartman. Minimum size is 40 centimeters. Let's use our Ken's fishing measuring mat. And you're allowed five per person per day. How's that hookup? Hey, wow. you took luck. Yo, 58. 58 guys. Look at that. Definitely keeping the fish. If you're not keeping the fish, please don't do this. If you're gonna return the fish because it removes the slime of the fish. But that's a beautiful hookup, guys. On a 58 centimeter Bartman. Yo! In the game. Well done. Shot. See Darren coming in the distance there. <laughs> That's a small bump here. Finger on the pulse. Let's get his reaction on this fish. Let's see if he knows what it is. <laughs> Nani! Bartman! Yes, sir! Bartman! Bartman, Hey, well done, Lani. Nice Good one. Huh? Yes, this blue water pool, it's a. What a pool. A chucker. No, prawn bait. 2 0 Chenu BKK prawn. Circle. No, normal uh, J hook. What a luck of fish. What a luck of fish, bro. Well done, man. Probably be 20 minutes before you found me. Well done. Well Short. Done. Yeah. Right here in front of this camera. A lot of small stuff in between here yeah, I can feel now. I think I'm gonna change the bait in the chase. Yeah, I got a bump, yeah. No, small. Just saying I'm gonna change it up and let's put a chocker, let's protect that bait a bit. From these small pickers. In the distance there, looks like he's on. Let's go closer. Painting small stuff. Ah, uh, small bronzy. Small bronzy, yeah. Ah, oh, well done. Short, better than that small stuff that was biting earlier on. Just too small, eh? Yeah, just too small. Yeah. Derek's also using a small 2-0. Yeah, 2-0 too. No, it's a 1-0. 1-0. Ah, oh, well done, man. At least you got a pull there eventually. Short. Ah, I live another day, bro. There he goes. Shot. <laughs> well done. Darren's around, there's always a chow. <laughs> What's in this roti roll, brah? Hey, have a bite. Lani. Interesting. Have a bite. Mmm. <laughs> Your favorite. My favorite, mints. <laughs> mints curry. Yeah. Mmm. <laughs> Sinker broke off, and I'm just gonna change my trace. I've been wanting to put on something else. We'll try for a different fish this morning. <clears throat> and we're gonna use one of those uh, landed. Books, one O's. I've already tried the trace at home. That's the trace there. It's a one O. Let's take this off.
it's gonna flap around and it's just gonna protect the underbelly a little bit that silver's gonna flash let's see what we can yield from this bait That I showed you just now. Let's try our best to get this lesser free. Yeah? Oh, Definitely all crappy. I'm gonna put him upside down. Please don't put this fish upside down, ladies. Try your best to keep him upright. Oh, there we go, free. Let's go put him back quickly. and off oh that's a decent fish ah didn't set the hook properly i just retied the uh sink sinker again because that line that i had on was just too thick for the t-swivel it just defeats the purpose the t-swivel wasn't moving freely yeah so the whole point is that you want it to move Freely. Up, down, up, down. There you go. Darren's keen to show you guys his bait up. This is cheap. Oh, now, if you want to see a bait up, there's the O that can produce a bait up. We're going to start in fresh. That looks edible. Bro. Fresh Natal side. Yeah. Underneath the belly. Yeah. And just wrapped in a bit of chocker just to make it a bit thicker. Looks hundreds. And that's what you have to go through. Look at that. Yeah. Look at that, to make those juicy baits. Yeah, Lani. Also running sinker, drop it down a bit. And he's got pink beads to protect uh, these swivels there. I don't know if you can see that, Lani's. <laughs> right, go for it. Uh, we've got a bite here. You reckon? Stone bream, Lani. Uh, he hook himself on that circle. Come on, come on, take the whole thing. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, yo, yo. Yes, yes. Almost, almost. Getting ready then. Getting ready, boss. And is ready. And he's hooked on that sack already. You think so, huh? Small fish. Yeah. I think it's a small fish hooked. And I'm stuck. Yeah, it's a small. Something on. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, small fish. Hey, it's a tiny old. No, oh, getting washed in the wave. Well, we'll know, now we'll you know what it is. Lively was. Ah, look at this. So 
told you, Carol. Moving nicely now. I must say, I'm really enjoying this precision, Lani. This 15 foot is doing the job. I'm enjoying it. Uh, I'm pulling a proper session here with this one, and and it's, enjoying it, I'm, I'm enjoying it. it huh? Absolutely loving it. See I'm gonna you. continue with this chase. I'm just gonna make the hook a little shorter. Thoroughly, yeah, there's my uh, tassel fish there, honey's for the pan. Hey, hey. Yeah. Sure. Well, this is looking good. Nice and inked up. Yeah, no, that's looking lacquer. Yo, 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 yo. Nani, let's catch a fish at dusk. What's the time now, you reckon? Oh. Pulling a proper session today, that's for sure. I don't know if this is going to be a long video, or I might just edit it to make it short. I did see we missed the video last week because there was no fish. My connection or fine was lucky to get that rock card because it was a low pressure system, the barometer was very low, and there was no fish biting, but he was he was lucky to get that rock card, eh? Yeah. And in Trafalgar as well, main beach. About two, three kilometers north from here. You did well there, yeah. well done for him. Sinker line is not long enough for me to clip this bait. But that's fine because I'm just going to lob it in the front here in the surf. And, uh, hopefully we can catch something this afternoon, man. More especially, I want Darren to catch something. He's got such a luck of visa today, he can't waste it. I hope he gets a fish. You know that cast because I'm using the chest mount, yeah only we've come up a little bit north away from the quarantine hope and i got a nice cast in in that white zone near the white surf there where that wave is coming up i'm about there somewhere so uh we're in a good place there i'm sure we'll get something now just over the ledge and that fish is back just over that bank, yeah. Yo, 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 yo. Follow it, man. Come on. Same bait, Lani. Lani. Big stick, cast there. Check, yeah. Let me just, let me just pull this one out first, quickly. Let me just pull this one out. Double up. Double up, Gabby. Yo, I mean, those are proper bites, bro. No ways. 